so we're going to be doing the blood lipid test. So 30 minutes before your participant gets there, you're going to want to take this out of the fridge. It is the lipid cholesterol kit, so you're going to want to take that out before your participant gets here. When you're setting up, you're going to want to put a piece of paper towel down and then set out your gauze, an alcohol wipe, a band-aid, a capillary tube, and a plunger. Let me move that so you can see it. So here's a capillary tube, and you're going to put the plunger in on the red side. It'll be the only side it fits in, so it's pretty self-explanatory. So you'll have that ready. And then I like to prepare the lancet before the participant gets here. So I always clean it off before with an alcohol wipe, and then you just twist off the top. See, there's already a sharp in there. I'm pretty sure it wasn't used, but we're just going to throw it away just to be safe anyways. And then you'll grab a sharp from one of the boxes and just twist off the top right here. And then you'll put it, the sharp in, kind of just mess with it until it goes down like so. So that's in there. And then you're just gonna put the lid back on and then twist it on. And then before you start, you're gonna wanna make sure it's at the deepest level. So if you twist the cap this way, that's gonna be a lighter. You're gonna want it all the way to the deepest level. That's how you set up for it. And then when the participant comes, you're gonna have them warming up their hand, either moving it, squeezing a ball, or clapping, whatever you need to do to get that blood moving. And then you're gonna to start to unwrap everything as they're doing that. So I will open the lipid cassette. This is trash, so you don't need that. And then you'll set it up to have the opening on the top like so. Just set that down. You'll open up the gauze, the band-aid, really everything you need. And then once your participant feels good and ready, like their hand is warm, you'll have them come and take a seat right here for me. I like to sit down too. And then they can either choose their ring finger or their middle finger, whatever hand you please. Which one? That one? All right, now don't be afraid to let gravity help. So keeping that hand a little bit lower than the heart, you can keep that down low. And then in order to prepare the lancet, you pull it up like this and then it is active and you can just hit that gray button and it shoots out for you. So now that I know that it's ready, I'm gonna grab the participant, ask, are you ready? Ready. Perfect. So I like to go just in a little bit towards the side now don't be afraid to apply a little bit pressure before you hit that button. And then hit that button and you should be good. Now you're gonna squeeze a little bit and then wipe away that first drop of blood. And then you're gonna quickly grab the plunger so I can pick it up. Now you're gonna wanna make sure that plunger sticks in and squeeze out kind of try and go in at a side angle. Don't be afraid to apply lots of pressure. And I think we might have to redo <laughs> this one. Keep squeezing. Mm -hmm. And just use that gravity to your advantage. Go in at an angle. Sometimes it's good to wipe away and then just get a full drop of blood instead of a like, yeah, sometimes oh, yeah. have the participant help getting that good drop of blood. We're going to want to make it all the way to this black line. It takes a little bit and timing <laughs> is of the essence. <laughs> yeah. There you go. 